Congresswoman Carolyn Bordeaux has sent a letter asking the governor to use his authority to make sure that Georgia school districts are protecting staff and students. She says not enough is being done to make sure safety measures are being followed. Over 2,500 parents signed a petition uh, to the Forsyth County School District asking that they um, follow some basic public health safety guidelines, including uh, requiring mask wearing in the schools. And the number one criteria that the CDC outlines as essential for the safe opening of schools is uh, mask wearing. You know, what, what we need is to make sure that our teachers and our school community, the support staff are safe when they're in that school and that we're following basic public health guidelines. So you heard from a number of parents that did sign that petition because they're concerned that what they're seeing in the school is not enough to keep, well, educators and students safe. Exactly, yes. And uh, also from teachers, their teachers are afraid to come forward because they're worried they'll lose their jobs. Is it your hope that the state would essentially crack down harder on the schools that aren't doing more in terms of safety guidelines and measures? Well, I hope the state will clarify that, that schools need to require students to wear masks. Um, it's really very fundamental. It's the number one safety guideline uh, put in place by the CDC. Congresswoman Bordeaux, who represents the 7th Congressional District, also sent a letter to President Biden asking teachers be prioritized in the vaccination efforts. She says she hopes that supply will increase over the next four to six weeks to get educators vaccinated.